Yo. Yo, what's up? Huh? I ain't shit, man. I'm doing a little, little documentary, little videos and shit for my, uh, for my channel. You okay. know about that truck life. And uh, we gonna be today's topic gonna be actually semi and hot shot. You know with the okay. dualies and shit like that. Right. So you know, I seen you over here with this thing, man. You gotta tell you gotta tell you gotta tell the people, man, about how you know how this how this thing works. Well, this is how this thing works. You, once you gotta get your truck first, and yeah. then get your insurance set up. Mm -hmm. You gotta have the the million dollar insurance because the kind of cars you're gonna be carrying on the back of this truck. Um, number one thing is getting your DOT numbers, yeah. getting your uh, MC numbers, get everything set up because this is the more you carry your number because you want to be able to carry. A, Cross state lines. That's okay. the difference in the MC numbers. Yeah. Locally, you can just if you're running locally in your city, you can have just a regular DOT number. Okay. Cool. Cool. You need a uh, CDL to run something like this? No, nah, you don't need no CDL. Just yeah. regular no CDLs. License. Just regular driver's license. Regular driving license. Then have a guy that know how to operate this bed. Yeah. That's the key thing to it, operate this bed right here. Um, be able to get the cars up on the bed. Yeah. If you don't have a um, if they. If the brakes locks on it, so yeah. Um, but so you, you that, use them them hooks right there, them them uh, them little those J hooks. J hooks, yeah. yeah. Those J hooks. What you do with those J hooks? If you say this in like a car is 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 down in a ravine, stuck in a ravine, you can use those J hooks to winch winch the car out of there. Oh, okay, cool. So that's cool. what that that what you use that for. So you don't need no CDL for this right here. How no, many? You don't how need many? No CDL how many car? How many cars you can pull? I can get two cars on here. One on the bed. Okay. Come back here and look. We can get one on the wheel lift. This is the wheel lift here. Okay. Cool. So you gotta have this set up right here to be able to do those do those type of things. So you just you just put them for the people that's watching. You know, I'm in the field, so I kind of know. But I just this content is for all them guys that that mm -hmm. you know. I got a lot of people that's hit my channel, or, or not my channel, but the IG. Right. And they um, they the company drivers, in the big trucks, and they looking for you know. I just I just want to give them another option of, you don't have to get out of a, being a company driver in a big truck to get into a, a owner operator, in another big truck, so right. to speak. Right. There's other options like like this tow truck. That's why I wanted to get this I mean, little shot. With this tow truck, this thing here, you're gonna be at home every night. Be at home it, every night. It, it depends on how you want to run this thing. Yeah. We run 24-7. Um, so, hold on, hold on. So, you run 20. So, no E-Law? No, no E-Laws. Okay. No, no, look, y'all heard that, right? No C, no CDL, regular driver's license, and no E-Law. So, no that e means you can run 24-7. Right. All right, cool. So, so, with that, we do, like, lockouts. You know, you have people yeah. locking their doors, locking their keys in their cars. We do charge change. We do... We do roadside assistance. We do it all. So okay, cool. Um, with that, you you're not limited. Yeah. With a, versus a semi truck, you're very limited with this with a semi truck versus this truck. Okay. Yeah. So you can so you can get that money around the clock. So hey man, you know that at the end of the day, that's what they want to know. How much money can you make? And and I say, I, I say like a six day week. I mean, on a six-day week, it's very, you know, you know, it depends how you want to run. Yeah. It depends who so you want to run it. If you run it, if you run it at least, you know, 12 hours a day. 12 hours a day, you should see like a six grand, $6,000 a week. Hold on, hold on. So $6,000. Yes. $6,000. Yeah. Wow. So you do the math. It's say, Vincent, like I went to Macon the other day. I took a car down there. I charged these people 450 to take this car down there. Yeah. Then I had a car coming back. Yeah. So you do the math on that on that on that trip right there. Okay. I charge them one twenty five coming back. You know, yeah. from that that took care of my fuel. And going that was down. only about three four hour exactly. turnaround. Exactly. So you made six six seven hundred. Well, you made about what six six hundred dollars in four hours. Exactly. So in the tw yeah okay I got you. So it it really you know it depends on how you running, and and what the flow is like because and then you can put. You can also do any kind of car. You can do auction cars on here exactly. too. Exactly. You can do auction cars. You can go to on Central Dispatch. Like I said, you just gotta have the insurance in place. Yeah. You know, to have the motor and carrying is a difference than the insurance and the okay. towing insurance. A lot hey, of so don't know so, that. so let's get a little deeper. What about what about uh, tags? Because like on the big trucks, the tags are you know shit. A portion IRP, a portion plate can run you fifteen hundred dollars. Oh, well, on these tags, right? You just gonna have a regular uh, twenty-six thousand pound, you know, tag. Okay, under tag. CDL, yeah. Right. Okay. So it's it's a difference in the class with the tags. Yeah. So that's a lot. That's way cheaper. Way cheaper. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Cool. 
Hey, man, I, I really appreciate you, you know, giving okay. us the time, man, because this, this right here is going to help somebody, you know, make a decision. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because I get a lot of people that's asking that, and some of the guys don't have a CDL. They want to get them, and it's like to be a right. trucker, you don't have to have a CDL and drive a truck. That's true. A big truck. That's true. You know, because at the end of the day, it's about the money, right? Exactly. So, I mean, you know, y'all hear it. The choice is yours. You know, I'm just putting the information out there for you. But this guy, man, and, and I got a buddy um, in, in Louisiana who has a, a record. He has a full car record, and he cutting cake, too. So, you know, Marv, man, Marv right here just told you, you know, if you get out there and run, you know, this is a real, this is a real hustler's truck. Cause he's a hustler. Yeah, when y'all, a lot of y'all gonna recognize this guy, man. You know what I'm saying? That's his, that's his other truck right there. He got that. He just grabbed that and just, yep. you know, put something together real quick. Yes, sir. And they just did about five thousand miles in that box truck, man. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, man. So, so this is, this is, this, this cool right here. I, I'm definitely, uh, this is definitely in my future plans, is to get me um a record like this because I, I had a trailer on my dually at one point and I kind of liked it man it was it was cool so again man appreciate, appreciate you appreciate it bro Word. thank you all right, right. y'all good